Hey guys, I'm Nick, aka the one and only Nick's Games, and today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to install custom maps on your 24-hour Minecraft server. For this tutorial, I am going to be using Apex Minecraft hosting servers. You can check them out in the description down below, or by clicking the annotation that's on your screen right now. They host awesome 24-hour Minecraft servers, but this will work for most other server hosts as well. So first off, we want to download a, a little program called FileZilla. Come here, and you want to click Download Client right there. So Download Client click that it will then take you through and you can download and all of that stuff once you've downloaded it installs like any other program have you installed Google Chrome Skype something like that just like that install it and uh, then you're good to go once you have it installed we need to go to apex minecraft hosting com slash multicraft right there so we go to that it'll take you to this page where you can then go to servers and then click on the server you want in my case that's this stone server right here click on that it will open up and then we can stop the server because when you install a custom app, you don't want the server to be up and running because that freaks it out in all kinds of ways. Once you've done that, you want to come over here to files and then click FTP file access. After that, you'll be able to get the FTP information that we're going to be using in FileZilla, which you can go ahead and open up. So let's put these side by side to copy and paste here. So we can go ahead and copy this, and there will be uh, some blurring on your screen, not a lot, some black boxes. But we want to take host and put it right here. We want to take port and put it right here. We want to take username and put it right here. And for your password, this is going to be whatever you use to log into Multicraft. So whatever you log into Multicraft with, that's what you want to put in password. I'm going to go ahead, get mine, put it in here, and I'll see you guys after a jump cut. Once you've got your password entered, go ahead and click Quick Connect. It'll then go through with a bunch of green and a bunch of blue, but no red. Red's not good. Once you've done that, you've got all of this stuff right here. You might not have as much as I have because I do have Rainbow running on this server as a secondary. However, currently, uh, we are running a default server here. Now, what you want to do to install your custom app is one, have it downloaded, right? I have mine downloaded right here, okay? So, what you want to do is you want to take this, right? and you want to rename it world w o r l d hit enter then you want to come over here and rename world on your server right as you can see right here you want to right click on that and you want to rename it world backup or world old i'm going to do world old it doesn't matter either way the reason you want to do that is if you say want to revert back to the old world you have it's right there in your server you just change it from world old to world and delete this that we're about to install now you want to come over here until you find world which as you can see is crisis craft so let me refresh that and as you can see right here it is world we want to take that and just drag it over here Drag it over, and as you can see, world, it's going through, installing stuff, entering stuff, doing all of the things, and it's going through and doing that. While it's doing that, we can go ahead and open up Minecraft. So if we go here, we open up Minecraft, and we can join the server in 1.8, join the server, and uh, get it up and running. So we go here, we go to Nick's Games 1.8 Play. And by the way, make sure this is finished, which it's not, as you can see down here. I have to wait to join the server. I also have to start the server again. So I'm just going to go ahead and while that's uploading, get ready to do that. Um, I'll actually go ahead and jump cut here. I'll meet you guys whenever uh, we start the server and join it. All right, so as you can see down here, it says queued files, none, and successfully transfers 125. That means everything has successfully transferred over here to world as you can see now we just need to come over here to apex and hit start it will then start the server and we can go over here to multiplayer right there it's starting and as soon as that turns green we will be able to play which we can reload here just in case by the way if you do start your server on multicraft and that's keeps refreshing like that refresh the page and it might turn green we can then hit join server and bada bing bada boom logging in we will have the custom map which by the way it may take a while but there it is there it is in multiplayer right and disconnect single player oh the world's not there anymore because i moved it but uh, there that's the single player world I can show you guys real quick. Let me install it back in single player, and I'll show you guys. All right, there we go. I added the world back. We can go into it here and wait for it. See, there it is. Same exact world. Close out of it. Jump back over here to multiplayer. Wrong server. Direct connect. 
to the server and bada bing bada boom here it is in multiplayer there you guys have it that's how you can install a custom map on a 24-hour minecraft server if you guys don't have a 24-hour minecraft server already i suggest checking on apex minecraft hosting rkt.us apex link in the description annotation on your screen all of that stuff anyway guys hope you enjoyed this video i'm nick's game subscribe if you haven't already make awesome minecraft tutorials every single day of the week and i'm out Pace. And here's some videos you guys probably want to go check out. On the left is Modtastic Episode 14. That's my weekly modded Minecraft Let's Play series where I go have some fun, play the Check It Mod Pack. It's awesome. And check out the video on the right as well, which is how to get bucket plugins in Minecraft 1.8. Yes, running Minecraft 1.8 with diorite and all that stuff. Go check it out. Also, check out my vlogs, the bomb machine schemes that I'm up to every single day of the week. Anyway, guys, I'm Nick's Games, and I'm out. Peace.